Right, another small category. Uh, best looking game. Oh, so small. Tough. It actually wasn't. <coughs> it's different different types of games this year than. Uh, actually, this might not be as contentious as I thought. The nominees are The Last of Us. I don't know if you've heard of that. Is this that best game. looking on a console or on the PC? <laughs> <laughs> let that, let, that, let that hang. I think it could be either. Just best looking game. I would say so. That the best version of that game. <laughs> Which game? Bioshock Infinite. I would say The Last of Us, even though being on a console, you, you forget it's on a console. Battlefield Four. But you're too busy Whatever. crying. Yeah. <laughs> Your eyes are all teary, so you can't <laughs> see clear. Tomb Raider. Beyond <laughs> Not Two cool, Souls. Matt. That was nice of you guys. <laughs> Who played that? Uh, Rayman Legends. I thought Andy played that. Yeah. Nino Cooney. I, I would. Yeah. I want to play it. I just haven't gotten to yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Not yeah. 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 Hell yeah. yeah. Nino Cooney. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get too hyped up and then it loses. I know. I feel like yeah, I feel like it will lose now. Like All right. Justin will make sure it's off the list first. Just, uh, first just because I list. endorsed it. Nino Cooney. So let's remove Nino Cooney right now. <laughs> and Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. Other potential nominees were X Rebirth, NBA 2K14, Arma 3, Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon, Grand Theft Auto 5, DMC Devil May Cry, Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Cold War as Gunslinger. Outlast. Eldritch. Assassin's Creed 4. Black Flag. Super Mario 3D World. Wind Waker HD. Dragon's Crown. And Gone Home. And New Wait, Leaf. Eldritch was on there? And yeah. Far Cry yeah, 3 Blood Dragon. Did we Far think Cry 3 Blood Dragon was unique? G- best looking. Best style. Best graphics. Most oh, technically style. impressive. Okay, okay. Man, I, I would have put, put, I I put, put Dragon's, wrote that. I those, put dragons those Crown like on here for that. Words that. It could be a game Dragon's that just looks look super look damn good or you just like the best, way it looks. Best style. Best graphics. Most technically impressive. Impressive. You pick. Unless it's Nino Kuni because it's going to lose. I think we should write that first. Studio Ghibli, guys. No, I've got... Okay, I'm going to just throw... Play an asshole court hard here, but Beyond Two Souls can just. I don't care. <laughs> I don't Willem care Defoe. about that either. I don't think it'll win. It's still too weird. Like, I haven't seen it. It's I, it's impressive, but it's still weird. It's a good looking game. It has but... the best looking Willem Dafoe I've ever seen in a video game. <laughs> <laughs> Even the r- real Willem Dafoe game. <laughs> Which you know the weird thing is is after that like game came out, I like Willem Dafoe, but then I was in a bar and there was a movie of him on, and he plays some weird stuff, man. He is like in everything weird. And then look up the movie Antichrist. Don't watch it, but look it up. <laughs> it is effed up, man. Thank you. It's <laughs> that, Ethan. That's all I got. <laughs> Willem Dafoe. Willem Dafoe. Willem Dafoe. Best looking game Willem of the Dafoe. year. Bird watching. Bird watching um, 2013. <laughs> the best looking game. Um, I could is, cut. So who's played Battlefield 4? <laughs> now I haven't had to play it, but I mean I've had watched you. Had to yeah, play it. <laughs> but I have watched videos and mm-hmm. things being destroyed, mm. jets flying by, sixty-four players on a, on like a PC. There's so much stuff going on, and the game still just looks chaotic and good mm. when it's working, yeah. I guess. <laughs> but yeah, it, it looks good. It doesn't have style, though. You know, it, I mean, it, 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 you know, some of these have more style. Well, it's got more gonna, realistic. It's kind of most and realistic. It, in its competition, yeah. I got to cut Tomb Raider. Yeah, I was going to I was going to say cut that Tomb Raider. But, yeah. <laughs> it has well, best, we, best looking be, hair, but the rest of the game is it's good. It's, it's all right looking the rest of the game. Seeing corpses everywhere is not um, my idea of best. And I want to <laughs> cut Brothers and Nino Cooney. I want to cut Brothers. I kind of don't want to cut Nino Cooney as much as I said. No Nino Cooney. It look I I like the style of that game. I I like the style. I mean it sounds it sounds really picky, but they were trying to pull off that whole animation style. But going going back and forth from the the actual animation to the end game stuff and seeing the it, because it's not completely yeah. seamless, I you know they didn't pull it off in my opinion. <laughs> so it's still yeah. beautiful, but like for what it was going for, uh, I could also uh, oh man. When we look at these five though, I don't. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. That's why I started looking at my other two options because I would I would take Nino Kuni over Rayman and Battlefield. 
but that's because I'm a biased. Oh, see, I loved Ray. I didn't play a lot of Rayman, but I love that. I like. Rayman. I love that style, but they didn't. What if we go set like set pieces? I mean, because Bioshock Infinite definitely had like yeah, just those I mean, like it, you, it had some really like, like you know, catch the, your breath. Doors oh, open up and I you walk out and, then, Bioshock and, and you just know, stand there for a minute, just looking at everything. Look at the buildings I can that. floating. Well, it sounds like no one yeah. wants Bio- Battlefield Four. <laughs> Did anything Battlefield Four? We can cut that for sure. We can drop it. And then what is the argument? Rayman versus Nino Cooney. Yeah. Rayman's a damn beautiful game. I think uh, I would have rather had Dragon's Crown on. And here it doesn't have your Nino Cooney Rayman. problem, I guess. <laughs> yeah, Dragon's I would, I would vote problem. for Dragon's Crown over Rayman. I need to pull up a screenshot of Rayman Legends. I'm trying to remember it. Dragon's. Uh, here's the th- I've got there's, issues there's, with Dragon's Crown. There's a thing with okay, so with Rayman Origins, I was really blown away with it, but like, and then going up. A console going up to HD a little bit with Rayman Legends, it just didn't. It didn't. Doesn't pop as. Yeah, it was something. As hard. Yeah, it didn't. It didn't impact as as strongly. I, I made the mistake. I played Rayman Origins on the Wii, so it it just looks like a game. It looks like a Rayman game. But so then when I played Legends, it so just that's looks. A screen, that's a screenshot from the game. It looks gr- great. Huh. Yeah. Wow. To me, that's the that's the way it hit me. I could see how if you played it like on PC or something. What, what's your What's your three? Last of Us, Bioshock, and then <laughs> I would not vote Dragon's Crown, but it would okay. be Rayman or Nino Cooney. And I was starting to get away from Nino Cooney simply okay. because of the seamlessness, seamlessness you mentioned, how it wasn't. Like you watch the animation and you're like, oh, that's yeah. good. That's Studio Ghibli. Yeah. And then you go to Ghibli. Giblets. 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 And then you go to Rayman. Rayman Legends is like. Start to finish. The Nino Cooney thing, would you rather have been like all in game? Yeah. What's the problem? Yeah. Yeah, there was. There was, you just it didn't was like the, the cartoon? It was the tran. The, there was a. There was a. The seamlessness wasn't there, and it, so I got taken out of it for a split second. See, I was. I love that because that was the. That was the Studio Ghibli. Like. Like. Ghibli. Yeah, like. <laughs> <laughs> New Leaf. Like. Ghibli. Yeah, like we're involved in this, so we're just going to animate out yeah, no, entire, I, entire sequences. I'm just saying. I saw what they're going for, but it—that's what sticks out in my mind. When like Rayman is seamless, Dragon's Cloud. I, like, I feel like the more I try and argue it, the more you the will, more you push you it. You will over. try and argue it away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just happy you haven't mentioned another game in about 25 minutes. So it was, it was, it was a great looking game. I but forgot what its name it's not was a, called. It's though. not. It's not on the it, up there with Nino Cooney and Dragon's Crown. No, I definitely pick one of those games. Of, uh, but yeah, Dragon's Crown just because that vanillaware style that I yeah. that I just love. But so yeah, but between that and Rayman, I'm starting to look at some Rayman Legend screenshots though. And man, that game. I mean, I, didn't, I, haven't, seen bright, the, I haven't seen the late game Chris. Rayman. Yeah, that game looks. Are real you okay with Rayman? Yeah. Well, I I don't know. Or I've Nino. never I've never seen Nino Cooney. I don't know what it looks like. Let me look it up. <laughs> He's stop, like, wait, stop your he's cookies like, for a wait moment. a minute. I can solve that problem. I right have the interwebs now. right here. Sorry, I was, co- I was cooking cookies. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the division. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that's oh. a game, not a cartoon. <laughs> My issue with Dragon's Crown, though, it's a really good looking I game. I know Vanilla Wear style. I'm still Rayman over Dragon's Crown. But Dragon's Crown has and some Nino weird over damn Crown. body proportions and some weird shots. Where, they so does David Michelangelo. That thing's Dragon's like, Crown way, way will too many, not win way too many because muscles of that ass. Way too many muscles. Okay. I think Dra- Dragon's Crown, you got your conversation, but... <laughs> <laughs> we gave you your five minutes. Shut up. I mean, I, I'm not... See, I like the dancing see, mouse. The, the thing with the Nino Cooney, in-game, it looks great. Those cutscenes look great, but it's like the transition between the two. Like, it just... I mean, I don't, the, I screen, don't even, the screenshots the thing, look I, I really hate, good. I, I, it's a good. I don't know game. why you have a problem with that. But <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't doesn't really explain itself. But I I get that you felt weird when you when you saw that disconnect. That's, that's yeah. So I guess I'm saying Rayman over Nino. But well, I'm fine with that. I didn't play we'll Rayman, so I can't I can't say it was okay. as great as Nino Cooney. So and then we all agree that Last of Us wins. Yeah. Really? I, no, I would have. I think I would have said Bioshock. The thing that that gets me with Last of Us is how good it looks on such old hardware. Oh, like yeah. it, it looks like a game that shouldn't belong on that system. Okay. It is a technically is impressive. So from yeah, the technically I, impressive yeah, side, yeah, and it I looks watched awesome. that on YouTube on my iPhone. So yeah. I'm gonna retract <laughs> my opinion. It, and Bio, Bioshock had definitely had some areas in the game where I'm like, man, that looks Bioshock fantastic. Some, yeah, uh, yeah, 
Yeah, I was going to say, Bioshock had some breathtaking moments, but Last of Us looked... Okay. It looked There's, like my kind yeah. of good. There's it, so it, much it, detail in The yeah. Last of Us. It all looks yeah. good. Last of Us, I think I feel like it's the first console game I've pushed, in, I've wa- pushed or played in a while that pushed PC graphics on a console. Since like bold claim, you know, I I think other games it I felt is. kind of that way was like Rage looked really good for a console game too. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. Best looking game 2013: The Last of Us. Uh, runners up tinkle. Bioshock Infinite and Rayman Legends <laughs> <laughs> take, the, take the computer with you got the tinkle 